Shalom, all praises to Yahweh, Bashem Yahweh Shai, and double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, Bashem Rakak Rabdash. My name is Yakawa from Plain Tables Camp in Philly. Now, if you didn't know, yes, even Alan Iverson was an initiate into this Masonic religion. All right, within this religion, they worship Satan. All right. And they actually have this cover of ESPN magazine for $472. This is March 19th, 2001. Signed, no label magazine, JSA. Not sure what that means. All right. We have more. The point is, once you reach a certain level within the system that Esau controls, which sports is, that's one of the bread circuses, arenas that, uh, basketball, uh, that uh, Esau, Edom, the devil controls. You become initiated into their religion, their worship. All right. And Alan Iverson was an initiate. All right. AI shakes the rap and rock and rocks the game, Notorious MVP, ESPN, March 19th, 2001, alright, now my point for doing this video is to uh, humble myself and, you know, the Akium, when we, when we reach a certain level, we're not supposed to be, we're not, we're not supposed to sell our souls, alright, we're not, we're not supposed to mind high things. And this is why a lot of these people end up uh, selling their souls once they get into their you know, positions. Whether for, for money or for power and or power. All right. This is First uh, Timothy uh, 5 and 15. Now this is referring to, you know, uh, wicked women that are faking, you know, to be humble. Uh, faking being humble, uh, uh, just fucking up for so long and then trying to get the act together at the last minute. Uh, busy bodies, all right? I'm going to focus on the 15th verse. It says, For some are already turned aside after Satan. All right? And I'm applying that as a general, as a proverb. For some are already turned aside after Satan. All right? If any man or woman that believeth hath widows, let them uh, relieve them, and let not the church be charged that it may relieve them that are widows indeed. All right, now we're going to look up, I believe, aside. Right, turned, turned aside after Satan. Turned aside. We got ectripo. Ectripo. To turn, to turn aside, to turn away from, shun a thing, to avoid meeting an associate. All right. So they turned aside and met Satan. All right. And the reason why that happened was because they weren't sincere. They didn't stick to the the main goal. The main goal was to worship Yahweh, Bahashim Yahweh, in spirit and in performance work. All right. That was a point there, particularly that verse. All right. Then we're going to get the book of it's a Philemon or Philippians. I think it was Philippians. Philippians 3. And. Start at 15. Let us therefore, as many as be perfect, be thus minded, and if any thing be otherwise minded, the power shall reveal even this unto you. Nevertheless, therefore, we have already attained. Let us walk by the same rule. Let us not mind the same thing. All right. And the old man, you know, the, the things we used to do. Because when you fall out of this truth, you not only you, you may not only do the things that you used to do, you may do things that you haven't done before. You may do new things. 
All right. Nevertheless, where two we have already attained, let us walk by the same rule. Let us mind the same thing. 14th verse, I press toward the mark for the prize of the high calling of the power in Hamashiach. Yeah, we're all pressing forward, forward to salvation. That's the, end of, that's the end of the matter, salvation. All right. Brethren, be ye followers together of me and mark them which walk so as ye have us for an example. Yeah, so you have an example of how, you know, the apostles and elders, you know, conduct themselves, all right? And we're here to follow that example. For many walk of whom I have told you often, and now let you even weeping, that they are the enemies of the cross of Hamashiach. For many walk of whom I have told you often, yeah, and the elders and apostles, they, they, Give us these examples, you know, some of them are living today, some of them has, have, has, uh, have passed, that they are examples of how not to walk, all right? And look, it tells you that they are enemies of the cross of Hamashiach, all right? Whose end is destruction, whose the power is their belly, whose God is their belly and whose glory is in their shame, who mind earthly things. All right? Yeah, we all get weak, okay? But overall, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah's elect don't mind the flesh, don't mind earthly things. All right? The belly, that's your, your, your lust. All right? Whose end is destruction? Yeah, if you, if you mind earthly things, if you mind your belly, I mean, you take that in the forefront of your mind. Instead of having the, the, the work, preaching the gospel on the forefront of your mind, you have your belly on your mind. And the earthly things, how you can obtain great things here. Instead of learning you know, to work with your hands and uh, be humble. All right. For our conversation is in heaven. All right. Not, not on earth. All right. So we're not about gossiping and exposing people, all right, exposing things unnecessarily, I should say. All right, we do expose, you know, the truth, that we reveal the truth, but we ain't going to be, be idle, idly talking, all right? For our conversation is in heaven, from hence also we look for the Savior, the Lord Yahushua HaMashiach. That's what it's about, all right? We press and forth toward the mark, like we read in the 14th verse. I press toward the mark for the prize of the high calling of the Most High in Hamashiach Yahushai. All right. So we're not to mind high things. For our conversation is in heaven, whence also we look for the Savior. That's the mark, the prize, which is the crown, the, the kingdom of heaven that was promised only to. The Israelites, according to the promises, in Genesis 17th chapter, 13th chapter, 15th chapter. All right. Who shall change our vile body that it may be fashioned like unto his glorious body? So we're going to get them those new bodies. According to the working whereby he is able even to subdue all things into himself. Yeah, he's going to, con con he con con going to conquer death. Everything's going to go under Yahweh Shah's feet. All right. So we're not to be, we're not to get to a, a point and then think that we're finished running the race. You know, we're still, we're still running. We still have to remain in order, arranged in a particular way. All right. We're not going to get to, you know, uh, whatever ranking system you have and you, and you even to the next to last one. And then you think you don't have to, uh, you know, follow the proper channels and have the, you know, the. The, 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 a certain level of decorum, all right? You, you still have to hold on to those things, all right? And that works both ways, all right? And the last scripture I have is Romans, the 12th chapter. Romans 12...
and 16. Be of the same mind one toward another, mind not high things, but condescend to men of low estate, be not wise in your own conceits. All right. So we're going to look up. Be of the same mind, one toward another, mind not high things. We got Hoopsalas. High exalted, uh, with an uplifted arm, for example, with signal power. Metaphor, eminent, exalted. Influence, honor. To set the mind on to seek high things as honors or riches uh, to be aspiring. All right. Be of, this, be of the same mind one toward another, mind not high things, but condescend to men of low estate, be not wise in your own conceits. Yeah, when you uh, dealing with the, uh, a heavy topic, you never just. Uh, just go zero to zero to one hundred, or you know, just lash out. All right, for lack of a better word, you, you take counsel. All right, wising yourself. All right, so instead of taking counsel, you should you're supposed to take counsel before you lash out. All right, because you feel you're being oppressed, especially in this body. All right. You got uh, he oto he oto he oto he o he oto himself be of the same mind one toward another mind not high things but condescend to men of low estate be not wise in your own self all right I guess we can, we can look up uh condescend all right we got sunapago or right. to lead away carry away this is condescend uh, a thing uh, so as to experience with others the force of that which carries away to yield or submit oneself to lowly things conditions employments not to uh, evade their power all right meaning to be humble be be low all right with with, with wisdom that right? doesn't mean you some, you uh, you know you're a pushover because you get the, you can get that far and that can be sin also but you know you just conduct yourself properly all right, and a guiding line is uh, how the disciples treated each other, how the uh, elders and apostles treat each other. All right, yeah, it ain't perfect all the time, but you know, one thing we ain't gonna do, we ain't gonna get on a damn video, start cursing each other the hell out. All right, especially when we had <laughs> didn't have a council. All right, on what the issue was. All right, all right. to yield. Or submit oneself uh, to lowly things, conditions, and employments. Ho holding a sign. Some guys got problems holding signs. All right. Not to evade their power. All right. So when you get your position, don't sell your soul. All right. Like so many Israelites have done. So I hope you guys ratified. Till the next lesson, Shalom.